My name is Dylan Rowe and I'm a first year graduate student in the post-professional athletic training program at the University of South Carolina. Today I will be demonstrating the Stimson's method for reduction of an anterior lenohumeral joint dislocation. Remember, for all dislocations, it should be done with the permission of a supervising physician. So your patient is going to present to you with their dislocated shoulder. You're going to have them lay prone on a table. Provide them a towel to go under the clavicle of the affected side. And then their arm is going to be hanging slightly off of the table. You're going to provide a weight around 10 pounds for them to hold on to in the arm that's hanging off the table. They're going to lay there for a couple of minutes until the spasming muscles relax and the joint will spontaneously go back into place. Uh, remember to be checking for neurovascular function and distal pulse before and after the reduction technique. And then once you have the joint reduced, you can um, send and refer for further imaging. That's it.